because the least push-ups in a minute will be eliminated right now. Uh, <laughs> push-up challenge? That's up. Come on, man. We gotta... I'm sorry to see you go. I'm going to be asking you guys a series of questions. The two lowest scorers will go home today. John, Nick, I'm so sad to see you go. I'm 22. And I'm one of the plug. And we're the founders of Plug Talk. And today we've got eligible bachelors here. And we're going to find out which one is worthy of being our next threesome. At the end of the series, you can see who won and the scene on OnlyPlugTalk.com. It was day two. I made it to the final six. And the competition out there is looking kind of weak. Like, I'm here to f Lena, so, you know, I'm going to do what it takes. Well, it's a new day. It's early, man. I'm, I'm here. We got a few customers out last week. Guess what? I'm, I'm here to stay. I'm not going no motherfucking where. Today we are doing some physical challenges, but I also really want to get to know the guys a little bit better so that the person that I, f I have, like, a real deep connection with. Hello, hello, gentlemen. Uh, Welcome uh, back to another day. You guys are the lucky six who are left. It's a big deal that you guys made it this far into the challenge. There are hundreds or thousands of male porn stars out there. I guess we're just ready to find out which one of you has what it takes to win the heart of my wife. The heart. Ooh. Damn, I mean, like that booty. <sighs> mm. Anyway, yeah, she's a snack. I'm ready. I want to tear that pink outfit off. And eat that coochie and sauce. She looks so delicious. And I look at Adam and I'm like, he definitely can't be hitting that right. So that's why he called me here. So for today's challenge, you guys get to pick a partner. So the person you pick is going to be your partner for this challenge. And you guys have to depend on each other, you know, to make it through to the next thing. Why do we have to have a man? Why can't we have a woman? Well, uh, she's she's. Come on, we're out of jail. We don't need no fucking man to help us do shit yet. Okay, it's not like you're gonna f the guy you pick. It's just you're gonna do some sort of oh, challenge no. with them. This yeah. is your teammate. I'm looking at Crip Mac. I'm like, he big and shit, so if we doing like some physical shit real quick. I'm like, all right, I got that nigga, but I ain't know what we doing. So I'm like, you know what I mean? We might be running, it might be a relay race. So I'm like, all right, I got my boy Jay. You know what I mean? I got to rock with that D, you feel me? That's my dog, you know what I'm saying? And if anything, we gonna make sure he win. He can't be on a loser team, you feel me? I feel good. I've been working out the last few days and I really, really want to f Lena, so let's f***ing go. I don't give a f what partner it is. I'm gonna win regardless. Let's win this sh Real quick. I think these two have decided to become partners, okay? Why wow. did you guys make this decision? We won the push-up challenge together, you feel me? You guys got good genetics, it's undeniable. Okay. What was that, what was that boy name? Uh, Brad, what? Brad <laughs> Rowley. We got, right, we got right boy out of here, you feel me? So we gonna get everybody else out of here right now. Do we have any partner combos over here? I think, I think I'm gonna pick Alex right here. We got Lil D and Jay. Thugger, Alex Legend, Crip Mac, and, and Alex Illustrates Cuh. What do you like about Alex here? I mean, I seen him stretching this morning. It's some like, you know, some of these. Some of these. I mean, it's, it's solid too. So I think like, yeah, we might look kind of maybe not the biggest dude out here, but he's got might, experience. Yeah, we might do some damage. He's the oldest here. He's got experience. So that's why I chose him. Okay, so today's challenge is physical. It is called Tug of Love. However, the person that you picked as your partner is actually your opponent. Uh, oh, that's oh, it. It's sticky mode. So what the f that mean? You so that means you're going up against me. So. Oh, so you, you just got f***ed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he just got f***ed. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's terrible. Awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. That's awesome. I gotta go up against Crip Mac. It's like I went from thinking I had the biggest advantage to having the biggest disadvantage. So just so you guys can stay motivated, the top three winners of this challenge are gonna get a little up close and personal with me. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. so put in all that effort, okay? I am a single man. We got Lil D versus Jay Hefner. I get busy, you feel me? I be, I ain't new to this, so I'm like, let's see what's up, man. I got this nigga. He little as shit, you feel me? I'm the biggest. Time out. Low with it. You know you going home, right? Nigga, you going home. What are you talking with. about, nigga? Put you on the floor. No, nah, well, pack I, him I, up. Well, All right, got it. Right. Hey, you ah! Nigga. <laughs> 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 
It must just be something in the air with Lena and everything. They're they're getting a little competitive. Homie, you get into it. You know what I'm saying? It happens. But sh no nigga thought he was fucking with the kid. He wasn't fucking with the kid. I had to show him something. You feel me? I almost dumped his in that water like a paint. Lil D stood his ground right there. I thought he was gonna beat his ass for real. So that's gonna be spicy when they go at it. I'm gonna have to charge that nigga Adam though. It's alright. Don't trip. Yeah, I'm definitely not paying for that. Hey man, I just want you to remember when you're in there, when you're tugging on that rope. This is the man who broke your chain, who almost took your manhood I from mean, you. So you need to bottle up that rage inside and let it out on that rope. Why, bro? Don't listen to no Zesty, nigga. What? Zesty? Oh! He just called me Zesty. I heard he that. He might be eliminated just off that alone. I almost don't care how good he is at pulling this rope. OK. Three, two, one. Tug. Come on, come on, D. Do it for the chain. Do it for the chain. It looks like size matters. Look at him. He's ragdolling him. Oh, no. Oh. oh. Jay won the challenge. Yeah, hey, yeah. You feel me? Came back from the victory and shit. You know what I'm saying? I already knew it was a win when they said we had to go against each other. I'm like, damn. The tug of war, Lil D and Jay, I feel bad. Lil D, a little scrawny motherfucker. I'm like, oh, shit. Talk up. Damn, you cut that out. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We have Crip Mac versus Alex Illustrate. You're going down, motherfucker. I doubt it, man. You're going down. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna get you. I don't think so, man. I'm gonna get you, motherfucker. Guys, it's just a friendly competition. Come on. Do you guys want to shake hands before this? Yeah, I'll shake cut hands. All right. Yeah. Play the best man win, huh? Best of luck to you both. Three. Two, one, tug. Oh, oh Alex is putting in work. Oh, come on, come on man. You better oh. fight for that. Oh, oh, go. Come on, head back. That's good. Good match. You hold it down one second off. 55th Street, let's go. Good. That was good. Hey, good, man. Strong mother. Right here. I might have lost, but I didn't lose that bad. So I got him stumbling. All I gotta hope for is that Lena saw my strength and saw that I was able to handle a man almost twice my weight. Alex was kind of holding his own for the beginning. Crip Mac was, you know, maybe taking it easy, but he definitely wasn't winning. He just powered his super Crip strength up and pulled that shit and Alex went flying. Alex put up a pretty good fight. He, uh, he didn't go down like no chump. He did terrible. No strength. A custer, a scrawny. Mother All right, we have one final bout. Our final two opponents. We have Thugger versus Alex Legend. Did this man win? Go, man. Maybe a pretty boy, but you're going down. Well, I mean, you know, it'd be nice so far, but it's a fucking nice time he's over, bro. You're out. Nah. Yeah. Uh-uh. Yeah. That's me right here. I picked this old motherfucker, so that's going to be his kryptonite. Being in his 40s is not going to go well for him, so. I got this in the bag. Thugger looked already a little bit like so, so, so. I was like, let's get in this motherfucker's head a little bit too. Oh, okay. Oh, he wow. He's doing push ups. He's getting really hey, ready. Don't do three push ups. If you lose, I ain't going to lie. You guys ready don't to go? Do no oh, yeah, don't okay. Do no push -ups. Okay, there's more happening here. So this motherfucker brought gloves. He took his shirt off and he's doing push ups to try and impress Lena. Like, nah, bro, you're doing way too much. I got something for you. Uh, nah, he got a lot going on right now. On the count of three. One, two, three, tug. Go! Oh. Oh. Ah. Go, pull, Tugger! He's turning red in the oh. face. Look at oh. 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 oh! Wait, Wait you lost. Bad sportsmanship. I'm weak. Oh, what? man. Well, the rope, the rope is on my side. I won. I, I guess Alex Legend is our clear winner. Tugger, what happened? He came prepared with gloves, doing push-ups, like, yeah, what, doing all that extra shit. Man, I don't got time for that shit. I just let that shit go, because I want to see him fall on his ass. He coming in here with gloves, 
doing the most trying to impress her, like you look stupid on the ground now. Yeah, everyone was like, oh yeah, you're warming up, you're stretching, you're doing all that shit. I was like, yeah, I mean, you know what? Like we're doing that challenge. I'm gonna fucking win that challenge. And guess what I won? Yep. He did show up with some gloves on. I guess he didn't want to damage his hands from the rope, which at first I thought was a little silly, but then a bunch of the guys actually really did injure their hands through doing the tug of war. So I guess it made sense. I don't know exactly what Thugger's big idea was because he was acting like he was gonna do this little prank by just letting go and having Alex fall on his ass. But that prank also forced Thugger into the losers category. So I'm not sure if he thought that was a brilliant idea or what. I honestly feel like he just didn't want to lose for real and he just wanted to pretend that he didn't care about it. So the three winners today, Jay Hefner, Crip Mac, Alex Whoa, Legend, yeah. congratulations. Soon I'm gonna be changing into a bikini and we will be going into that hot tub right behind you, having some- As hot as a mother out here though. <laughs> having some drinks together, so, uh, and my husband won't be there. Yeah, I'm gonna go kick my feet up, take a nap, Make sure you guys treat my lady right in this hot tub, all right? I'll text you when we're done, okay? Yeah, thank you. That's very What's nice of you. On? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They said the winners get to go in the motherfucking jacuzzi. I'm like, damn, mud. I'm hot. They get to go into the hot tub, the jacuzzi with Lena? I want to see her in a bathing suit. I want to be part of that. What is that? I figured it was only fair that she get an opportunity to get to know them a little bit better. This is the first time that I'm getting really up close and intimate with the guys one on one, kind of, because Adam was in my ear that other time. But I'm a little worried because, like, Krimak is there and, like, he's sort of gonna dominate everything in the date. I don't know. I just, I want to hear from the other guys, too. I need a goodbye hug. Hold on. Let me get a goodbye hug, bro. What, what do you because... mean? You just lost, bro. Just let it go. It's okay. You're not going home today. Going You're home still home. in the challenge. You're good. Okay, see you guys later. Uh, even Stevie Wonder knows it's 55th straight, and Cub can't even fucking see. I know he's wondering, like, damn, wonder how I can see what 55th Street looks like. What that baby snatch 55th Street Alley looks like. He wants to know. Have Cub go over there while the homies is getting DP, Cub. All Cub gonna hear is niggas' heads getting busted open. <laughs> Stevie Wonder be like, God damn, Cub, it can go down out here. <laughs> 55th Street. But now we hopping in the Crip Blue Water, and we're gonna have a nifty time. Lena, bring your ass over here. Let's go. Oh, there she is. Hi, boys. Hey! hey! Damn. What up? Oh, yeah. You guys are already in the hot tub? Ooh-wee. I'm finna beat that motherfucker down on God. Lena's a very sexy woman. I don't tear that motherfucker open. Come everywhere. Yeah, I mean, Lena, she just bent over and like from where I was, that booty is something. And then, I don't know, like she was just taking her shoes off. No one's going to help her. I'm a gentleman, I'm French. So I went out and I helped her and helped you. Oh, thank you so much. Such a gentleman. Thank you. Thank you so much. Right. Yeah, right. I think, ooh, this is very hot. Get down here. He's such a gentleman. And I mean, I didn't really expect it from Crip Mac, but like not even Jay, he's not even trying a little bit. Catching my eye, I'm taking note of that, you know? You guys won the competition. We know you're very strong. How about that ass. You could potentially lift me up physically. Oh, yeah. During spin you, this uh, spin you around. sex scene. You spin me around, OK. Yeah. But you know, everything we've done so far has been like kind of surface level. And I just really like to get to know you guys a little deeper. Um, Alex, I'm going to start with you. Sure. What is your biggest red flag? I don't know, maybe that I could, uh, sometimes I could come like too easily for a girl if like she's really kind of you like fall in love guy. too easily yeah I could, I could i could sometimes i would kind of i feel like you're very emotional if you fall in love easily and i feel like oh, that's not emotional. really a red flag to me i feel like that's really sweet cut cut for france right yeah He's... shout out france cut <laughs> Yeah, so Lena was just trying to ask more like personal questions. I think it was kind of cool, to be honest. Like she wants to know like what's going on and maybe that might help her just make a, a better decision. But then Creep Mike, oh, damn, he couldn't stop talking and talking and talking. I mean, like, bro, it's just kind of like, where's the volume on this guy? Hey, Creep Mac, just keep talking the whole time. This is funny as hell, though. Jay, I feel like you have a thousand red flags, but can you give me your biggest uh, one? Yeah. I'm just a hoe. You're a hoe. Okay, yeah. That, that's, well, that's I mean, I guess quite I'm... a big red flag. Doesn't really matter for me. Well, when I'm in a relationship, it. Lena, I, I am a faithful man. You are. What, I would, am... your, what would your ex-girlfriend say about you if I called her right now? Oh, sh 
<laughs> drink beer all day, hang out on 55th Street. Alex, you've seen the other competition. You've hung out with them a little bit. What qualities do you have that set you apart from the other guys that make you think that I should choose you? Well, it's going to be a boy, boy, girl. So I feel like the guys teaming up together and feeling like they're really like making it happen for you to just kind of give you a great scene is going to be key. And I vibe super well with Adam, so I think we can really make that happen. Competition is not the best for those kind of scenes. So you want people, you want teamwork. That makes you're, the you're dream a teamwork work. player? Yeah. Yeah, somehow I feel like maybe Kravak is not a team player over here. <laughs> I so am Matt, a team player. Why should I pick you? What is well, the quality I'll... that sets you apart? Well, I, I really gang bang, and you know, also I take care of the homeless. I love the homeless. That's why I should have sex with you. You want to have sex with me because I'm a nephew, nickel, nickel. I'm a great man. Something warm like a gorilla bear. Jay, as I've said in this competition, you've been the most confident out of everyone. What makes you so confident? Why should I pick you? Have I lost that all yet? Probably not yet, but maybe a little bit of luck was sprinkled in there. Oh, hell no. I, hell I, no. Think, I think you like cub. All right, you like cub. <laughs> I will say oh. that I'm I'm very attracted to Jay. Cause I got the dreads and the tattoo like the Waka Flocka. Girls look. also don't the like... The stitches love niggas that look like cubs. Girls don't, don't like, like, like ice cube. Out of all these guys, who would be the worst person for me to f Adam. Oh. He's not in the hot tub. Why are you just in my bed? Oh, you talking about in the hot tub? I thought you were talking about everyone. Oh, wow. I oh. feel like we should get a boy girl first. To, just us? Yeah. We had a problem with Jason. That Why? Was what, what was the problem? Learned. I'm gonna be different. You know, Jay, 100% super attractive. I'm, I'm into his looks, but the more I get to know him, I'm just like, he's a cocky mother He's throwing little jabs at my husband. You know, I just, I just don't even know if he really wants it like that. He's kind of like, I got this, I got this. Very like cocky vibe about him. And the more and more that I see that, the less attracted to him I become. Yeah, I mean, honestly, like that date is turning into my favorite because if, I mean, like I'm connecting with Lena, uh, I mean, look, like, Creep Mike can't stop talking, but just about, like, some hood stuff, nothing about her. And, uh, gee, I don't know, he seems like he's just chilling the hot tub, he doesn't care. So, this one is on me. Creep Mike, what's your longest relationship? Well, at least two years, and then it went off and on, cuz I kept going back and forth by jail. You know, I knew Sir? she was beautiful. I'm like, goddamn, I hope the homeboys ain't fing her. <laughs> <laughs> right, Jay, uh, what was your longest relationship? Uh, four months. Oh four months, that is a whole Answer. You were such a slut. Were you cheating? Hell no. You was loyal? Why did it end? I didn't want to be loyal no more. I wanted to feel. Alex, uh, what I is got, your longest relationship? I got three different ones that were around like four years. Oh man, he won. You come. Of course, my longest relationship four months, you feel me? But that shit don't even matter for real. Like, we came here to you, you feel me? We came here to lay pipe. And say goodnight, you know what I'm saying? All that relationship for you and your husband. What the f Well, you know what? We're here, we're fing me and her going f So it doesn't matter what kind of relationship I was and how long it was. I turn around because I hear someone walking in. Whoa, Whoa excuse Whoa. me! Thank you, Joe! It's Alex Jones. You guys don't even know how much I love this man. Surprise, motherfuckers. It's me, Alex Jones. They told me they were doing a little competition and they needed someone to, you know, spice it up, so I'm coming through. Hello! How are you doing? Okay, um, I told Adam Hello? that... Oh, what up, bro? I had a little crush on someone that we saw at the Halloween party the other day. Was it me? It was absolutely <laughs> not you. You were not there. Thank you, Lena. God dang it. Wow, thank you, Adam, wherever you are. Thanks, Adam. So yeah, I planned a surprise for Lena. We had, uh, my friend Alex Jones show up in the middle of the whole thing, and I figured this is one of the best talents that we've worked with in the adult industry. I've seen him lay it down before, right in front of my very eyes, and he's definitely got a monster hog on him. How the f you gonna bring somebody in here? We done did like ten challenges already. Like, you know what I'm saying? We done all won. We done all earned our spot. You let dude. Just walking this motherfucker freely with a bag. This motherfucker Alex Jones comes in like <laughs> disrupts every fucking thing. He's one of the homies, but fuck, man, it's just kind of like I'm trying here, and then you just fucking come and destroy the game like that, showing like halfway through, like you have to do like half of the. I don't know, like I ain't worried about it. I ain't going nowhere. Adam, why are you inviting more guys, Bob Lena? Well, you know I'm gonna win at the end, and I'm fucking your wife. Okay, you in my seat, yeah. Huh? You in my seat. I'm in your seat. Yeah. 
I like them in your seat. Nah, you gotta go over there. <laughs> go over there. Go over there. Oh. He ain't checking in. He ain't checking in. So I'm over here, I'm looking out the window. I see Lena looking way too hot. Dude, Alex Jones is here? He's my boy outside of the show. But here in the show, he's my competition. The f why do they get to get that shit? Like, they barely won. Man, you know what? I'm actually about to crash this shit right now. Oh! Oh, oh shit. wait, what? Oh, yeah. You guys lost. Wait, who, who lost, baby? You guys lost the contest. Oh. Oh. What y'all doing? Yeah, let me get up. Let me get a little bit closer. What y'all doing? Let's hear about why he's here. Yeah. What's up with that? He wasn't here last time? So we, we were at a party, and Adam said I should come through because the competition was lacking a bit. What? Damn. So, oh, wow. So we come through? Oh, word. I, I, I don't really see no competition <laughs> yet, so I'm chilling. So you guys are a little pissed that he's here. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it ain't fair. Who are you most attracted to out of these guys? Not including you. Not including you. Okay. Uh, if I had to go based on only looks, I picked Jay. But Jay's personality does not do it for me. He's a little cocky. Love you, you I feel like personality-wise, would finish the deal in this scene and there would be no mess to collect afterwards. That's what I'm talking about. I wouldn't about. have to hear Just about him again. He kind of looked like Adam. Three. I'm gonna take care of Adam, Adam 21. 21. Three on my Adam 23, yeah. 23. I hate the least attract. <laughs> what the f What's wrong with you, niggas, man? I'm just saying, you said the least. You look like your husband, Adam. You're really just trying to, like, be with me only. Like, you don't want Adam a part of this. We could get married next. We got Jay over here talking about, I look like Adam. Like, that's an insult. Dude, that's her husband. It's like, this is an advantage. I look like his little brother. I don't know if he thinks he's gonna win points with me by throwing jabs as my husband, but I, I don't like that. He's losing me. I mean, this is a, a team project. Like, you have to include my husband in this. Oh, look at this spicy boy. Oh, look at this. Man. 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 Hi, gentlemen. Today's elimination is gonna go a little bit differently. Adam and I get to collectively vote out one person, but you guys also get to vote out one person. However, Adam and I get to pick one person who has immunity. You guys cannot vote him out. Things are getting real, gentlemen. So Adam and Lena are gonna vote somebody out, and then the boys, we're all gonna vote somebody out. I'm not too worried about Adam and Lena. We seem to vibe pretty well. I just hope the boys don't conspire against me and vote me out. The guys aren't gonna eliminate me. They're fans of me, they're fans. I'm somebody famous, they're already fans. All of them are fans. This is gonna be really tough. They're all hot, they all have something to offer me in the bedroom, I just know it. But I have to make a decision. Who will I send home today? France motherfucker. This motherfucker. He has to go. Let's eliminate this piece of shit. I don't even know his name. name. I don't make the rules. She said he was the most attractive, so we gotta take out the threat. My vote is for Crip Mac. We got into a fight, so I just don't want it to happen again. So which, which stuff? How long? They, they all gotta go. Jit, it's 
Sorry, bro. I mean, you're cool and stuff, but she likes you and I want you out. Who you voted for? I voted for Jay, because he a threat. You know what? I voted for you. Hey, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> I ain't a lot, dude. Because I remember. I was trying to fucking go back in. They ain't give me no time, nigga. I was trying to figure out who voted for who, so we called vote for the same motherfucker. Just get him out of here. Bro, I think I think they might have voted. I think Alex Jones might have voted for me too. So you trying to pack me up and get me out of here? Nah, nigga, because I talked to Crip Mac. He said he voted for Frenchman. Um, Jay said he was going to vote for Frenchman. Oh, so we trying to get the Frenchman out of here? It looking like he might get packed up. But I, but Alex and the other white boy that look like Adam, mm -hmm. they was plotting. And they asked me who I thought, but we didn't get to figure it out. Man, I hope I don't go home because of your Just wait and see. So we've tallied up you guys' votes. We know who you guys want to leave. But first, we're going to present who Adam and I want to leave. And this has been a really, really tough decision. Yeah, it's so hard. So the person that Adam and I have decided to vote out today, I'm so sorry. It's Alex Illustrates. No! I don't know, I'm bummed. I really thought I was gonna f Lena, for sure. I thought I was gonna be number one, but now I'm here. We have three Alexes at this point. One of them has to go, and he is the Alex I've connected with the least, even though we've had quite some time together. So, you know, your time is up, buddy. We decided that we had to eliminate Alex Illustrates. Super nice guy, and they're saying that he looks like me. Which I guess I could see it a little bit. They, they call him Adam 23. I don't know. He might be more of an Adam 21. But um, yeah, I don't know. It's just like we got such star power in the room. So we got to rip that band aid off and just get him out of here. Thank you guys so much for the opportunity. Adam, thank you so much for almost letting me f your wife. It's your loss. But this is Adam 23. I'm out. One Alex gone, one more to go. I'm excited to see who the guys are gonna eliminate. It'll tell me who they're threatened by, who they think I like the most. It's gonna get interesting. Okay, now for the person that you guys want to send home. I was actually very surprised by this decision. The second loser of today is... Jay. Whoa. I gave one person immunity, and I think you guys probably thought it was him, but it was... What? <laughs> okay, so hold on. Alex just shows up, and on top of that, you get immunity. Doesn't do any of the Chinese. You just Chinese. got here. You're like, you, you, like it's, it's. I mean, I love, she, I love the dude. Though. She I love chose the... to give Alex immunity. You guys chose to send Jay home. Let's just make this perfectly clear. This was not our no, no, decision. No, I'm not talking about that. I'm just saying that when is this guy gonna start like putting some work in to kind of like get that scene? Though? Well, Jay. I think everyone thought I was gonna save Jay, but they all wanted to send him home because I said he was hot. But Jay hasn't given me any dances. Jay don't dance. You don't dance? Jay is scared of booty holes. Yeah, yeah, I gotta make sure you're real sanitary. And Jay has been sleeping on set a lot today. He's <laughs> folding me out, dog. Ain't no fucking way. They got the kid up out this motherfucker. It's crazy. And I ain't gonna lie, I ain't think he was going I thought the Frenchman. And uh, Adam's little brother was gonna get voted off. You feel me? I thought they was gonna go first. Hey, don't fucking hate the players, hate the game. It's just, uh, I gotta vote someone out. And uh, yeah, in this case, you know, Lena, she just said in passing that she was kind of vibing with Jay a little bit. So, I mean, if the dude is out, it's kind of like helping my case. He was a, a competition a little bit because he's strong. But fuck, uh, he's gone now. I'm closer to Lena's coochie and I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Even Lena said that she thought that he was the best looking guy out of the bunch. But during the course of the past few days, honestly, he just wasn't really in the zone. You know, he is super hot, but I don't think he's as hungry for it as the other guys. So I'm kind of in agreement with the dudes. They picked the right guy to eliminate. Sorry about that, man. These guys are ruthless. Yeah. So basically, Lena, we have a fire starting five here left. And we've got some tough choices to make. I think we need to do some more challenges. Yeah, I agree. For the love of Lena. For the love of Lena. 
all of you are gonna give me a nice little lap dance. Crip Mac! Can we see their d Is that possible? Can you ask them? We finally come to a decision, and the person who's gonna f my wife is...